for the top 10. My turn, Switzerland. This song, very positive about love. True, Eurovision. And very dense, and uh, the guy is a very handsome. Musically talking, as I say, I think it's very, very, very current. I think it's very uh, to date. If you go to a club, just a normal club, yeah. wherever, in Europe, in Spain, in England, here in, in the Netherlands, in Germany, they're actually listening to reggaeton in Spanish. So the fact that uh, this guy from Switzerland is singing in English, but a song with this rhythm, yeah. reggaeton, yeah. I think actually this, this is a good stuff, you know? I don't say like, oh my god, the mesh is given so strong and powerful. No, no message, no message. Is a... There is no message no about message. it. Like, I like the song birds dancing with me and I'm doing it with reggaeton. Every song must have a message or something. Well, like let me that. tell you something about this song. And maybe because it's European, but most of the, song, but most of the songs sound in Spanish is is like very miso misogynist, very about like, oh yes, I'm a guy, and I want to f you, and I want to f you four times, and all the stuff. Latino temperament. Exactly. Toxic masculinity. <coughs> no, no, no. Honestly, okay. in times of feminism and all the yeah. stuff, the message of reggaeton is not really that nice. So the fact that you are go coming here with a very good looking European guy, from Switzerland saying like oh yes the way you look made me feel like I want to dance with you and stuff so nice. it's nice it's positive it's a make positive you smile, make you smile morning exactly exactly so Russia Russia and uh, yes this guy is the second time in the Eurovision second song time, festival, yes. festival and the first time when he was it was awesome really nice yeah song. that time and the was really show good. was really fantastic yeah. I like the emotion and like actually this guy have really nice voice and the guys look also good looking okay that song is a typical Eurovision can win but I don't know if somebody you know come back you know the second time mm -hmm. to the Eurovision it's always like oh you try again because you never win before so mm, go away probably again he made the big show you song. might be surprised but actually for me this song is one of my top worst songs of the year I understand that this song is clicking some bells for a certain I... population but this is really not what new music sounds this mm, okay so this means you know I'm a little old-fashioned or this kind of things you know but for, the, for, like, the for me this for me this song for the Eurovision it's really good and actually you know statistically talking yeah. With all these YouTube views and all the stuff, he's placing number three. So he might have a chance. United yeah. Kingdom. This song is really nice. The guy, oh, this is the nice, you know, like to, so, to show you the contrast because the guy is not very handsome with beautiful body or this kind of thing. What? 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 He's cute. The, the most important is your, your five seconds, you know, first five seconds about the songs. And for me, it was like, you know, I hear, wow, nice. I really feel nice. You know, I can hear you. I can listen to the song, you know, every morning. It's nice. I know what you are saying. And probably this is just my personal taste, but for me, this the song is also dated. It, it, when I listen to this kind of song, it reminds me of Rick Iglesias when he was not famous internationally. Oh, you always you know thinking about somebody because somebody no 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 believe me I have heard that before like uh, Rick Iglesias singing casi una experiencia religiosa sentí tu beso cuando tú me tocas like really like gospel feeling stuff like I've been there I hear that that already happened to me it's like thank you next Greece. yes. Really, really nice song, Greece. Congratulations, Greece. I hope the show what she want to show in the in the in the in the Tel Aviv that will be little the same like the video clip because it's really nice. It's really nice. And uh, she looks nice actually. She looks like also typical Greek. The, With the, the face, black hair, and the yes. curls. Yes. It's not song for the win, but. Uh, Maybe it will be in the final. I think so, yeah, for, for sure. I do love Greece. I actually think that what she is doing is a very Dua Lipa. That's my stuff about European Zoom Festival. Or probably that's a personal taste for me. But it's like I want that European Zoom Festival is showing, showing what is happening now. What people, people is really listening now. 
And I really think that Greece has it. Slovenia? Slovenia. Slovenia? Yes, and uh, this is uh, also, it's a ballad. Mm. You can say it's a ballad, but it's a little alternative ballad. Oh, honey, this no. Is something, no, but this is, it's a lovely song. I like this song. And I really want, probably I will listen to this song later all the time. Maybe not all the time, but a few times. And uh, yeah. Like. This is something different, but this is, yeah, and this is also what I want to say, I uh, like, it's uh, like, for me it's a nice, you know, when the, everybody's singing in their own language. I like it. That happened in the 90s, I like it. Okay, maybe it... <laughs> and, uh, yes, this is like, you know, for me it's like when I hear this song, you know, I can see also Slovenia, you know, how this be it's a beautiful oh my God, country. Okay. So, I don't doubt about it. People from Slovenia, please take me there. Yeah, it's a really nice. It's a really nice. Now, I the like song. It. I'm sorry, not for me. No. Not this time. Yes. No, not happening. Maybe not in the final or something like that, but probably the song will be in the memory of a lot of people. Uh, my next country is Serbia. Serbia. Yes. Serbia. 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 How? Yeah. Thank you! Ah, no! Thank you! Oh my god! <laughs> Never again! It's horrible! No, it's not horrible, it's a beautiful ballad, it's a beautiful woman, and she's singing really lovely, she's singing in English, she's singing in her own, uh, own language, and uh, the Serbia, I think every year for me, that makes me, you know, like, wow, the feeling inside the song, and I love it. You have the Netherlands, which is a ballad, okay, which is current. But then you have this battle from Serbia that is like so f nineties girl, beautiful boy, kids over here, hair over there, yeah. and it's like you know. <laughs> no, I swear to God, to me is really dated. This is like Eurovision song festival used to sound. In the nineties, Sweden's a nice, uh, little gospel song, a very gospel song, but positive gospel song. Shit. I'm actually confused. This year we have like two strong contenders singing gospel, and gospel was the stuff that people used to sing in nineties. You know, so it's like and I again understand. we have nineteen. Well, exactly. So uh, it's making me wonder. It's making a question to myself. It's like. Is Nike's back? Musically speaking, is his back? Is gospel a stuff now? So, oh my goodness, you all are thinking like you know something come back, something not come back, and at this moment, Sweden it's a nice. This nice song, the gospel it's a nice what they did. It's not like every country sing gospel. They choose, you know, like now they sing gospel, so gospel. So why not? It's just come back, it's just come back? Yes. So come back? Yes. So come back, maybe yes. wrong. Welcome in Europe. Okay. Europe is telling to the world, gospel is back. Yes. Austria. Austria. I really don't like it. And her voice is nice. No, and yeah. especially... And the video clip is nice. Is it like no, I mean, I she's found there, this... you know, she's just there, and she's singing, she looks nice. It's a nice. I mean, she looks nice because she has blue hair. I don't have blue hair. This is normal now to have blue hair. The hair color make you good? No, it's not like about the color of the hair or something, but she looks just nice, you know. She, she looks great. Yes, and song is really nice. No, I mean, I'm sorry. It's I mean, something happened with the song, it's not boring, it's not like, you know, I'm singing, I'm singing, I'm singing, and then, and then, and maybe I want to win Eurovision or something. No, no, no. No, to me the song is boring. Not, no. This is the kind of song I used to do, like, does someone want some, something to snack? Like, really, honestly. For me, that that's the kind of song. I'm sorry. This is what. Uh, Do I hurt your feelings? No way. Good for you. Azerbaijan. 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 Wow. Congratulations, lovely guy. <gasps> oh my God, he's cute. He's not cute. He's oh, handsome. Oh my God, he's... I want to have baby with this guy. <laughs> Azerbaijan. It's a not typical uh, the uh, Azerbaijan song from the Eurovision. Because uh, uh, what I remember about Azerbaijan, it was like, you know, the sexy woman and bam, 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 hair, and hair, boots, and, oh, and everything is totally sexy. Guy. And yeah. now they make, you know, it's a man. Yes. A sexy man. Yes. And uh, the song is nice. It's really nice. It's like, 
not from Azerbaijan, it's like really, you know, like, wow! Yeah. It's, I'm really surprised about this song, positive. And uh, yes, yes, this, I is, this is one of the, my favorites. I love, of, uh, love the song so much. And um, is, this, is this the best singer? No. Is he good looking? Very good looking. The video is amazing. Yes. And what I like about the, the video is like so queer. I mean, it's like. I, I, uh, everybody knows, you know, the song festival, the, the Eurovision song festival, it's a, it's a, it's a queer festival. It's about being weird. Yeah. And yes, I believe because it's Europe, but hello. But so it's like, yes, mm -hmm. it's so queer. But most of the time, people mistake being queer with being gay. And yeah. this guy is weird and he's so masculine like mm. and i love that and i remember the video what? and i love this uh old woman with a wig and i, I with these weird people over there and it's like check 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 i gotta find that outfit i'm gonna wear it and i actually want that wig in my birthday boom